All right, uh, back and let's start looking at the markets from the weekly. Uh, weekly, we can see we got a nice hammer formation, meaning that the bears pushed it all the way down and the bulls were able to fight back, recaptured a 10. MACD is curling up. We want to see this continue to break this high. Uh, break this high of 184.77 and we can definitely see some follow through going there. Uh, volume is good on this hammer and follow through came today. I mean, excuse me, this week. And uh, if it breaks above these highs or let's say if you even want to wait for the breakout, just the breakout of the high of 184.94, 185 and you're back running. So that's a good sign. Uh, Diamond as well. Uh, it is testing these levels, uh, these levels that we had. Let's kind of take this off. Uh, yeah, let's delete that. And you can see this level uh, pretty much from around here, this last pivot point, and it is testing it. And we want to see it continue. Uh, MACD is flattish, and we got another hammer. We had a recapture, but again, if we could see it clear this 161.83 or even better would clear this 162.53 then we could get it back to the highs uh you would use something i mean if you're looking at the weekly time frame i mean i'm pretty much looking the low of the week uh to really be the stop if this is the time frame that you're looking at uh we really need to be careful right now because if you look on the diamond you could see that we have a left shoulder head is this a right shoulder I don't know, but uh, again, we, we really want to see what, what's going on and if it could break up and continue uh, to the upside. We have the Russell, Russell uh, hammer last week, golfing this week. I want to see it get above this level. I want to see it get above this 15, excuse me, this 1155 level. I want to see it get it back there so it can recapture into the the channel that we've been talking about that's pretty much been present for the entire year get back in that channel and continue to the upside but i do like this engulfing pattern a lot uh qqq strongest out of them all breaking out to new highs really really love it right here right now so the tech names is definitely something that again the hammer came and it was from a while back let me see if i could there's a level that i had here either way uh, we have an engulfing on the monthly. We have a golfing on, matter of fact, not engulfing, a hammer and continuation with some nice follow through MACD curling up. If it could get, break above this 90 area, 91 area, it could continue to the upside. I'm, I'm looking at this. I'm definitely bullish on things right here, right now. There's nothing in the charts telling me not to be. Okay. Uh, let's look at a couple names and. Um, Again, for the let me point this out for the weekly for the dailies, uh, just be careful that you're not chasing because this is a lot of days up. So you know, make sure you're looking for some type of flag or something to get in. Just don't get in blindly. You know, if you can break above high, if you're high of uh, these highs, then you could continue to the upside of this day, which is uh, 9091. So kind of see how it goes from there. Uh, some individual names that look good to me as uh, one package that looks good breaks this high keep the low of the day as my stop i'm good i'm going long on that uh disney broke out um nice little flag pattern broke out and if we have some continuation again i'm looking to get in above 79.47 that one will look good with the stop at the low of the day for my trading style um this might be a little bit different play but you, you can't see like a flag uh, you know for this as well if you do it something like something like this something like this right here let's create parallel line you kind of see what I'm where I'm going with this uh, that's kind of like a little flag that you could see from right here and if it could break above that high then it, it, you know we could definitely come in and, and test these areas as well this this looks good to me if you could break above there again I need a break of that high of uh, 6587 to get to get in that one uh, and the last one is uh, our RTN uh, this one looks good a uh, little bit choppy uh, quite honestly but if it can get nice engulfing pattern um, if it could get above this high of 9629 that one looks good it gets some follow through on that Let's see if there's not anything I'm really missing no I think that's pretty much it so if it, it's it's moving pretty good so far uh, this would be a good play, uh, maybe for Monday and stuff like that. We've got very, very bullish MACD right here, right now. 
Um, and that's pretty much it. So I'm going to do some other videos. Um, but I'm glad to be back. And uh, expect more. Take care. Thank you.